Okay, guys, you're welcome to this particular video where I will be actually introducing Forex to you in another way. And also, I will also show you an example how Forex is being traded. So, I'm Rani Rastan Gayap, and I will be your humble teacher throughout the course. Okay, guys, probably... This is maybe the second time you are, you are hearing again about Forex. So Forex, as I said in the previous video, is the exchange of one currency against that of another country currency. So it's basically the exchange of money. So Forex trading has to do with the trading of money, currency exchange. And so I want to take with you uh, take you to the chat, a forex chat, which is basically an example. It could seem strange to you, but don't worry. We are going to learn about all what you see on your screen. So here I'm on a platform called Trading View, and on this platform, I'm going to break out a currency pair, which is called USD CFA franc, and I will show you a chart of the currency pair and exactly what is being done. So on this chart, as you can see, I can say that this is a foreign exchange market. This is the market which is being traded. And uh, what I want you to notice here is very simple. If you look at this chart very well, you are going to notice that uh, there is something very, very important that I want you to notice here. There is this uh, graduation here with different amount of CFA. So you can see here, this is a CFA, and this is a currency pair USD safer. So on this currency pair, at each point, one uh, USD, for example, is uh, equivalent to, one USD is equivalent to any amount of CFA in this uh, axis here. And so you have here in the middle some information about the chart, which is represented with a, with a candlestick chart. So this is just a representation of price fluctuation, which is represented in bars. So you have the blue bars and the red bars. So this is just an illustration of two currencies that can be traded in the foreign exchange market. So at this point, as we are speaking right now, you can see that the exchange rate for the dollar against the CFA is standing at uh, 589 francs CFA. So this is it. You can see this line. This is exactly where the chart is, this blue line. So with this, if you also go up to, let's say to Google, and you search the USD against the CFA, let's just say USD ZAF or Google, you are going to realize that what Google is going to give you is almost the same thing. That is it, 592 francs, almost the same thing. If you come back to the chart, it's as 593. So just a difference of one franc. So exactly what you see for exchange rate on, in banks, everything, it is gotten from the foreign exchange market. So you now understand that Forex is a real thing. It's a real deal. So what people are going to be doing is that they will study these things that you are seeing, these bars, these things they call candlesticks, they are bars. So they are in blues and red. So when the exchange rate of a particular currency is going up, it will be represented by the blue bars. When the exchange rate of a particular currency is, is dropping, it is represented by a red bar. So for example, we have this period behind here where we have some consistency of red candles. So I will just map that structure for you and let you see, and then let us take a simple scenario. So I've mapped the ups, the lows, and the highs. So at the up bar, the exchange rate was 608 francs, and at the low bar, it was at 595 francs. So there was a decrease in price or the exchange rate of dollars against the safer from 608 francs to 595 francs. So that is a decrease in exchange rate. So once we spot such opportunities, we are going to place a sell order for this currency pair and we'll make money as 
the currency exchange rate drops. So if we also do another analysis and see that the exchange rate of this currency is going to go up, rather we would buy. So what basically we do is that we need to have a proper understanding of the way that price fluctuation is represented. So we are going to use past price information. We are going to use history about that price fluctuation or exchange rate fluctuation to predict the future. So forex trading is one of the real businesses you could engage online. So that is just one simple example. So now this platform that I'm showing you is called TradingView. It's a platform that is used to analyze, to see the exchange rate, to find opportunities to buy and sell. So I'm also going to introduce to you other applications where we can now use to buy the currency pair, like an application where we go now, we, we buy and we sell. So when you, when you get engaged in Forex, you now need to understand that there is a couple of applications that we're going to be using. So we are going to be using a, a platform to analyze the market. And also we're going to use a platform to enter our trades. So I know you are going to be wondering, how do we get money into the foreign exchange market? How do we withdraw money? All of those things. And I'll explain to you very, very fast. So permit me share with you now my phone, where in my phone, I will show you exactly how it is being done, right? Uh, for you to actually uh, get more knowledge about what uh, I'm about to show you. So let me just show you in, in a very fast way. So let me share with you. So I will stop sharing my, screen, my, my computer screen with you and I will take you to my phone where most of the trades are executed. So, so I will share with, with you the screen of my phone. So, so here you can see the screen of my phone. So here is another application, which is called MT4 application. So in this MT4 application, this is where we carry out the trading. So what about this application? This application is like, it opens you to the exchange market. It's like a market, in fact. So when we come to here, we are going to see different currency pairs. Like for example, this here, we have this one, um, the GBP against the US dollars. So it's a currency pair that we trade. So it's been listed here. And what happens here is that we simply just need to uh, come on this, uh, on this platform and we go to, we just simply need to come on this platform. As I've shown you, we go to the Trading View app and we can see different currency pairs like this one. And I can press buy. The market is closed. <laughs> Definitely is uh, end of year. So, and at the time I'm recording the market is closed, but I just wanted to show you that here you can actually have the buy and the sell button as you can see. So this is where we can actually come and buy and sell on this platform called TradingView. And also on this platform, we can see the amount of capital that we have. You can see here, the capital here is 500 US dollars. So what happened? How do you even get money into you, the trading app? So from every indication, I, want you to, I just want you to understand that for you to trade Forex, you need a trading app, which I'm going to teach you how to use it. So what happens here is that this MT4 application is a broker. Uh, sorry, it's, a, it's an app where brokerages now, you, you don't link your brokerage account into this app. So to trade Forex, you need a broker. A broker will be that institution that will stand between you and the central bank. So you will create an account with a brokerage site and then the brokerage now will then give you uh, a login detail to come and log into this MT4 application. So when you deposit money with a brokerage, you will come inside this application, you will see the money. And in this application, now you can use the money to buy and sell different currency pairs and generate profit. So when you want to withdraw your money, you simply go back again to the brokerage site. So it will be a couple of interface. So we're going to have where we analyze, where we trade, I'll have a brokerage. So like a three platform something. 
So, and you are going to be taught on how to use all of these things. So I just wanted to show you so that you can understand properly what uh, Forex is all about. And I'm going to teach you in the next video much about Forex, the time we trade Forex and all of that. So I believe that each and every one of you is okay. You guys are okay with the fact that Forex is something that you can trade from your mobile phone. And again, it's something that is very easy to do. Anybody can trade it. And you just need the good knowledge about the Forex chat and anything that comes with it. So I believe that uh, with this, we can say that uh, you guys are okay. And uh, we're going to see you in the next video where we are going to be talking about different time that you trade Forex and we explain more to you.